A Fort Worth Texas police officer is on administrative leave after he shot and killed 28-year-old Titania Jefferson through the window of her own home while she was babysitting her nephew. Now, I don't understand why the training is so bad that people forget to say, hey, put your hands up, I'm a law officer. Because yeah. that's what, you know, he was supposed to do. Yeah. Put your hands up in the name of the law. Identify yourself. But then I look and I see Texas is going crazy because they walked a, uh, a young man who had some mental issues down the street between two police officers on horseback mm -hmm. with his hands tied. Yeah. And then, of course, we know about the... 2019? Yeah. Yeah. About a couple of months ago, it's it's it, it is the cr Both of Gene who was shot eating who ice cream in his eating own apartment. Ice cream on his, so I have to assume that something is missing in Texas. Well, well I, I just don't know assume. why. What's going on with de-escalation training? Like that's my that would be my first question for these police officers because in most situations like this, at least militarily, you're trying to de-escalate so it doesn't resort to violence. Mm -hmm. And he just shot a woman sitting playing video games with her nephew in her home. I don't understand well, it. What's strange he is that the, the, he was, eight, he was eight years old. Her nephew. Uh, her neighbor called because their front door was open. Her neighbor was concerned for her welfare. And the police officer goes in her backyard and, and doesn't announce that he's a police officer. Yeah. And she peers out of the window because she hears what could be an intruder in her backyard, and he shoots her through the window. And I mean, I think, you and know, doesn't black identify and doesn't identify himself as a police officer. I mean, you can't, as if you're black, you can't eat ice cream in your own home. You can't go to Starbucks. Wow. You can't barbecue while black. Now you can't, but you know, be, be with, safest... your, with your video, you, playing videos with your nephew in your own home. Why are black people disproportionately shot four times more than white people in these United States of America? I don't understand. What I would like to suggest, because we're going to talk about this more, but we have such a big show coming up that we're going to get through it. Uh. But yes, I know. <laughs> I know, I know. But what we want to say is that this is a detriment to everybody. Yeah. If it can happen to black people, it can happen to Asian people and white people and men and women, this is a problem.